Welcome guys. Here is how to make use of Threads on your PC. So Threads is now available on PC and you can make use of Threads easily on PC without any issue. But then guys, there is a quick information. If you have never used Threads on the app, it's not going to allow you to use it on the PC. So let me show you guys. I'm going to try to log in my other account I have on Instagram, but I have never used it on Threads. So whenever you use it, it tell you um, before you can before you can log in, you will need to set up your profile with Threads app. So you cannot set up your profile making use of the um, already existing app, which uh, uh, already existing website that is available. So you need to actually download the app. Probably they are looking for for more downloads on the app. So I'm going to enter in my existing Threads app to show you guys how Threads work on PC. So um, I was using login detail for the other account. So I have my detail logged in and a security code is going to be sent to my phone number, which I just received right now. And I'm going to try to enter in the security code that was sent to me. So once you enter in the correct detail, it's going to load up and display you your Threads web. So um, it's actually active and you can notice they also sent a message saying the Threads app is live and everything you need to know. So quite, there are a lot of interesting things about Threads web. This is very similar to the Threads application because this is a web version and I think they will have to improve on this. So let me send my first message. To make a message, you can just click on the post. And then click on post and anyone can reply. I'm okay with that. You can change this if you don't want everyone to reply. And then if you want to search, you can hit the search icon. You can make search of anything or you click here to make a new thread. I'm just going to click outside to cancel that out. And you can see your followers by clicking on this icon on the top area. And then these are going to show my followers and the people that I'm following. And this is actually my profile area where it displays my profile, display my previous trades I have posted. This is my replies. And then this is my repost. So and these are actually my followers displaying right here. And to go back to the feds, the threads feds, click on the um, home icon is going to take you to the home page. And it does the same thing with the threads web. And also guys, you can click on the menu icon by clicking on this area to see more information. And then there is switch, um, switch appearance, there is about, there is report a problem, and then you can log out. So if you click on the switch appearance, it changes the color of, um, it changes the display from light mode to dark mode. And then if you click here and then switch right back, it's going to switch right back to light mode and you can log out by clicking on this area. And that is all the application can do. When you scroll down, it keeps scrolling, it keeps loading new face for you. And this is actually the bottom. It's going to load up again and the bottom is going to disappear. But then you understand that is stress up. So guys, um, I hope this video is helpful. I uh, I don't think there is any other thing about the Threads app in, in words that it's making it look unique, but um, having the web, actually, um, you can also upload images and videos just like you know. But then I don't think um, there is more tutorials to make about Threads app, or if for any reason you are finding anything challenging, just let me know on the comment section and I'll make a video about that.